key motivation is because we want our staff to be fully engaged with our business. Um, our strapline for a long time has been TLC not PLC, uh, which is tender love and care, and we really want to treat our staff in a way that we want them to treat our customer. The policies that contribute to the success of our business from an HR perspective are um, the ones that most businesses would have, so we have a well-established effective performance management system which we've just reviewed and is operating pretty well throughout all parts of our business. That's linked to development plans for each of our staff, we're very keen on, on developing staff at all levels, helping to, them to achieve you know, their maximum potential. Um, we've got uh, quite a sophisticated reward system so that we, we benchmark our salaries against other financial organisations to make sure that we're competitive and uh, we have a, a bonus scheme in place, a modest bonus scheme in place may I say. Um, you measure success in a number of ways, although I'm a firm believer in um, if it's working you don't really need to measure it because you can actually see it happening around you. You know, you get a sense that people are motivated, they enjoy working for the business. You know, you, you can hear people t having conversations in the staff restaurant, in reception, and if, if they're very positive and upbeat, then that's a good indication, really. Staff engagement is very important for business survival, particularly in a service business like ours. We work in the financial services sector. We don't provide a tangible product, so it is very, very important, particularly for our frontline staff, to be engaged you know, to understand what the business is about and be able to explain that to the customer um, and also to provide excellent customer service. We're always trying to come up with new ideas for the future and we do look very carefully at what other businesses are doing. Um, I don't want to give too much away because we have one or two, two ideas in, in the pipeline but once, one thing I, I will mention that we've been working on recently is, is flexibility. Um, we think it's very important that, that staff are prepared to be flexible and that we encourage them to be flexible. Um, and over the last couple of years we've tried to promote a culture of flexibility within the business. It's important that all our policies, HR policies and practices are designed with the same purpose and ours are and they're based upon our values. You know, we, we have um, values which, which are like our DNA throughout the business. They guide, in, guide us in terms of how we treat our customer and they guide us in terms of how we, we treat our staff. Winning the Employer of Choice Awards um, has meant a great deal, um, both, I think, not just to me, but to, to, to my team primarily, um, but also the business. I think for, for my team and I, it's, 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 it's great to have that accolade, great to be recognized um, externally in terms of the work that we've done here to, to engage our staff and to promote well-being and, and positive working practices.